Hi, I'm Tasman Opley, cosmetic chemist and trainer here at the Institute of Personal Care Science. And today I'm gonna to show you how to make a anti-stretch mark cream. Now let me show you how easy it is to put together. Okay, so firstly I have my water phase here. Now I am gonna be using this uh, PEMU Per Start Polymer by Lubrizol. So what I'm gonna to do to speed up the process of hydrating this polymer is I'm gonna add it to a bit of propane deal and do a slurry and then I'm gonna use my overhead mixer and I'm going to add it to my water. It will take some time to hydrate, but using the slurry method will speed up the process a bit. Now the Pemupur Star is a more natural alternative to um, polymer by Lubrizol. It's a really good option here for a natural uh, formulation. Okay, so now I'm just gonna start adding my slurry here to my water phase. So you can see now that a nice gel has started to form and it's thickened up quite a bit. So you can see that's turned into a beautiful, nice thick gel. Now I'm gonna add this to a bowl because I am going to add an emulsifier in my lipids. So I do need to heat it because I'm adding a waxy emulsifier. This is just to add a bit of extra vis viscosity, a bit more creaminess and a bit more stability to my cream. Okay, and while that's on here, I'm gonna to put together my oil phase. So in this bowl here, I have a small input of Olive M1000 by Hallstar. This is a good nionic waxy emulsifier. To this, I'm gonna be adding uh, some caprylic caprylic triglycerides. This is medium skin fill lipid. I'm going to be adding a small input of some aloe vera oil. Aloe vera oil is good for soothing and hydrating and moisturizing. I'm going to add some avocado oil. This is really good for dry skin. And I'm also going to add some shea butter as well. So this is going to give it a nice, beautiful buttery feel. It's going to be nice and emollient and creamy and we're just gonna pop that one on heat also. Okay, and once your waxes have all melted, we're gonna add that to our water phase now. And a nice, beautiful, creamy emulsion has started to form here. So we're just gonna remove that one from the heat. And we're just gonna to continue to stir that a little bit just to help it start cooling down. Okay, so now for my heat sensitive materials, now I'm gonna start off with our star ingredient here. This is our active. So this is the Green Tense by Bioli. Now, this has a really fantastic story behind it, something that I really love. So as uh, most of the ingredients from Bioli, there, it's upcycled, it's natural, it's Cosmos approved. So this active is actually made from the outer leaves of the lettuce that's normally cut off from salads um, that come in bags. So it's a food industry co-product fourth range salad cutting. So an upcycled ingredient from lettuce. And I love that story. Now it has some pretty good data here. It's got some smoothing, firming and soothing benefits. So you can see here on the first one here, it's got some in vitro studies for uh, collagenase inhibition. You can also see in this other graph here, it's got some really good firming data. It has a reduction of 63% of the lattice diameter. So you can see here, the first one is 18 hours and then 72. And then it's also got some soothing data here as well. So inflammatory cytokines inhibition. So the skin is exposed to different types of aggressions like chemical stress, like pollutants, uh, mechanical stresses like in, uh, irritations or injuries or biological stress, so um, UV. So to defend themselves, cells secrete um, cytokines such as the interleukin-1, which are inflammatory uh, mediators. So green tents at 5% is able to reduce up to 45% of that interleukin-1 
which is really good. And it's also used as a antioxidant as well. So it's got some pretty good data there. As I said before, it's Cosmos approved, it's natural and it's upcycled. So you can use it in your natural and upcycled and organic formulation. So it's ticking all the boxes there. And it's also um, China approved as well. Now I've got some coffee extract here. Coffee is good for using in uh, firming or toning products as well. And I've also got some ginger extract here. So ginger is really good um, at reducing the signs of aging the skin. It flushes out toxins. Um, it's good for evening out skin tone um, and also leads to more blood circulation. So a few benefits there for the marketing story. Um, I've got some essential oil here. I've got my antioxidant, my tocopherol, and I've also got my preservative here, which is the Cosphoderm multi Meg by Cosphotech. And last but not least, we're just going to check and adjust our final pH. And as always, you will need to cover it and let it sit overnight to check for any signs of instability. And it also will uh, thicken up a little bit as well overnight. Okay, and here's what our stretch mark cream is looking like the next day. As you can see, it's thickened up quite a bit. It's nice, beautiful, stable emulsion. Now that feels nice and beautiful and light. It's buttery, it's emollient, but it's not heavy and it's not greasy. It's very, very light. It's also long spreading as well. So you wanna make sure that you have some good long or medium to long spreading lipids in your cream because we do have, um, it can be quite a large area to uh, spread the cream over. You can get stretch marks almost anywhere. You can get them on your arms, your legs, your, your thighs, your stomach. Um, you can, you can get stretch marks anywhere. So you do wanna make sure that you've got long or medium to long spreading lipids because you will be covering um, a larger area or a larger volume of skin. It's also not tacky or sticky either. It feels actually really beautiful. Um, so you can apply this either you know during the day or at night um, because it's not, it's not heavy and it's um, nice and light and not greasy. So it's not gonna leave a greasy film on the skin. Well, there you go. That's how easy it is to make a natural anti-stretch mark cream. If you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave any questions in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe to receive notification on the rest of our videos. Happy formulating.